Hello everyone, welcome to another video. My name is Philip, I'm also known as PS or PS Enough, and today's video is about the demo scene highlights of 2012, trying to keep it down to 10 minutes video showing the best demos of the year 2012. Uh, to start off right off the bat, uh, we have to go uh, through the releases of Revision. Revision is uh, one of the biggest demo parties there are. In 2012, we had a few interesting releases. The first one that I wanted to show was uh, Kiowea by Mad Wizards. A collaboration between uh, the Polish group and uh, the, the Finnish uh, called our Bright Light. Uh, turned out pretty interesting uh, demo with one revisions uh, 2012 Amiga demo compo. It's uh, released for both uh, the, the Amiga AGA and the Atari Falcon. Also released at uh, Revision 2012 and also for the Amiga was a collaboration between Focus Design and Unstable Label. It's called Hot Dogs. Uh, had music by DJ Hoffman who was retired for quite many years and recently had returned to the demo scene. I think he returned in 2011. I could be wrong. This uh, 64K was uh, pretty interesting and uh, it won Revision 2012 uh, Amiga Compo. Uh, winning the PC 4K compo was Hartverdartet by Acronym Analogiker. I hope I said that right. Uh, it's pretty nice 4K fractal based kind of stuff, but done properly. Uh, it was pretty nice uh, entry by Scene Pacifist there. Um, but the real meat of a Revision 2012 was the 64K compo. Uh, we had three very good releases uh, that year. The first one was by a, a was by Razer1911 and it's called The Scene Is Dead. It got third place on the compo but got really a lot of votes afterwards. Uh, another collaboration between Rez and Dubmood pretty much. Uh, they, they were doing uh, quite a few series of 64Ks back in those days. And second place was F. Felix's Workshop by Control Alt Test. Uh, some French guys uh, pulling all stops on the 64K with a nice uh, virtual uh, workbench and uh, decent animation. Um, it's pretty good, um, and people thought the combo was over, except that uh, this slide saying Gaia Machina from Approximate uh, was on screen. And Approximate had been working on their engine for quite a few years, and they finally they managed to put something out, and it was really killer, uh, 64k. Uh, it really helped to resurrect the 64k a little bit, at the time it was a bit dormant with uh, both major groups from um, Fairlight and Conspiracy being a bit inactive and they were the kings of 64ks at the time. So this release was pretty good, uh, got first place at the Revision 2012 PC 64k combo. Uh, moving on to other releases that happened in 2012, at Demo.js 2012 we had a very nice 1K in JavaScript made by uh, Poi of Ribbon and Format of 8-Bit, it's called Matraka, also pretty pre worth checking out, especially if you like JavaScript stuff. Another completely off, off the charts uh, entry was uh, released at Art Party on the Wild entry for the, an overhead projector of all things. Uh, overhead projector demos are not completely alien alien from the demo scene. Uh, there used to be a compo at Wensley uh, every year for quite a few years and at party in the US adopted this uh, compo and this release came out which which had a lot of interesting ideas put together by uh, by Luis with music by Kant. So well done, Desire and TRSI. Uh, then we move on to Evoke. At Evoke, we had two very interesting entries on the alternative demo combo. In second place, we had Finally by Titan. It was a demo for the Wonder Swan. Titan became famous for exploring alternative platforms, and this is probably the best Wonder Swan demo out there. Um, so uh, it was a pretty good release, pretty nice, uh, I, I really liked it. And first place was a demo for the Commodore Plus 4. Uh, which is not a very famous platform. It's called Metamerism by Bocknecht and the Electronic Knights. One thing I remember from it is that it's quite, quite long, like 10 minutes, 12 minutes long. Uh, it had a lot of different effects, a lot of visuals, uh, like uh, pixel art stuff. Really cool stuff, uh, and it won the Evoke uh, alternative demo combo. Moving on, at Function 2012, we, are, we had a very nice 64K intro compo as an invitation for Tokyo Demo Fest, which I wanted to highlight, not just because it's terribly cute, but also uh, shows that the Japanese scene was finally taking shape and organizing itself to have a regular 
demo parties, which turned out to be quite a big success uh, later on, as you will notice throughout other videos. Moving on to the big party in uh, Assembly, we had uh, 1K that is quite worth uh, mentioning, it was called Traceless by TBC, participated on the 4K compo, uh, actually the 1K compo, I, I apologize, it got second place. Um, uh, another uh, entry that I wanted to highlight from Assembly is Space Cut by CNCD. Um, desktop doing some amazing stuff with smashes engine uh, really good things and i really loved it especially the intro and we got first place on the assembly 2012 combined demo combo a couple other releases also worth mentioning real quick uh square by still it won geeks can dance a small party in uh, sweden uh, then uh, Coma Light 13 by Oxyron won the Majestic X demo part in 2012. X is like the mecca for Commodore 64 releases and this demo was very highly praised and w with good reason for that I, I, I couldn't go by without mentioning it. And last but not least another entry that I wanted to mention was We Are by LNX, a new group from France at the time that won the ultimate meeting the last demo party of the year in 2012. They won the combined demo compo there and uh, they really set forth like a new wave of uh, French demo scene that actually came to demo parties and released stuff. So uh, new blood from the French demo scene, which was quite welcome. That's it for the highlight of the year 2012. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. All that jazz. See you next time. Bye bye, everyone. Take care.